Well, hello there. I'm the Ranger, and today I'm doing a tag for my 500 sub giveaway. I was tagged to make rope stronger by Bowling Cookie and use dinner floss to tie my camp up. So I got a couple flaws here at my camp. It's been almost a month since I've been out here, and I got to retie some of these things. Before I begin, if you remember this, where you get 20 feet of rope from off your clothes, this is that string off my sock. And I'm going to show you how to make this string stronger so you can use it. You can use it to fish with, and we'll see how much weight we can do with this string. I'm gonna make it stronger let's get to it and I want to tie my camp up with dinner floss and I'm gonna make dinner floss stronger I might combine both of them together or use one at a time and try both then combine both of them and see what happens see you in a few seconds well, hello there I'm the Ranger and don't forget I'm a fictional character for this channel that means Anything I say can be fictional in your mind. Thank you. Enjoy the video. What you need is a pencil or some type of stick. I'm just going to use this flashlight. I'm going to show you how you make rope stronger. All right. You see this? This falls right apart. Right now, what I'm going to do, I'm going to tie a rope to that tr tree over there, go back and go back forth one time, and I'm going to show you how to do this little thing. Let's begin. I'm going to fast forward this so you won't be bored. Starting now. Now, what I want to do is take this string and put my pencil or stick and like so. Now, once you back up, I want you to see what I'm doing now. What you want to do is take and do this. Now, it's going to get stronger and stronger as I do this. Dental floss will do the same thing. Just keep doing this over and over. Now we'll speed it up now. Alright, now after you spin it a lot, you gotta spin and spin and spin Especially this type of material. Once you spin it a lot, you want to fold it in half. Okay, now basically this is going to be the tricky part. Now I got to keep it from tangling, so I have to go half the way. So I got to get a, at least a some type of type of way of folding this in half. It has to be folded in half, and it will become stronger. All right, so I'm going to use the tripod as a this to keep it from um from from uh, twisting and I don't want it to twist just yet there you go now I'm at the end now remember what's going to happen when you twist it's going to tighten up the string and the minute I let this go it's going to bungle up so you got to have it tight at all times ooh, ooh. I'm just going to tie, I, I tied a knot. Now, when I let this go, okay, there you go. Now I used my tripod as a lever. Maybe you want to get a stick and stick in the ground because you got to go halfway. And when I let this go, it's going to tangle up. And see what happened. It starts to twine. That's what we want. Now we can do it again. Now, it depends on how far you want this rope. Remember, 
half the distance is going to be, if you go 10 feet, half of that is going to be 5 feet. So if you want 5 feet of strong rope, you got to go 10 feet. If you want 20 feet of rope, you got to go 40 feet. And it's kind of hard without somebody helping you because you got to fold this in half. Let's say this is the end, you got to fold it to that end. And once you let go, it tangles. I'll show you what it does right here real quick. Basically, you just keep it twisting. Twist it, twist, 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 twist. And when you fold it, see how it folds? Okay, come. All right, come a little closer. I'll have to do it again. All right, this is what I'm doing. I'm, this is my tie point, which is back there. And I'm twisting it. I want to get you real close. And what happens, this happens. And that makes the string thicker and stronger. Now, this little part is twice as thick. Now, I can hang stuff up. I can't break that. In a few seconds, we're going to take and see. And you see how it tangles up? That's why you got to fold it right the first time. Always go tangle up. Now, I can do it again. So, I want to back you up. Go get my flashlight and do it again. Now, I'm going to make this rope twice as strong. And this is this thread from... If you watch that video where you get 20 feet of uh, rope from off your clothes, this is off my sock. Okay. Now I'm going to do it again. I'm going to show you just how strong this can be get. So you're out in the middle of the woods and you forgot rope, you forgot string, or you got lost and you forgot you don't have rope, you don't have string. You got almost 100 foot of rope on you. You just have to unwave it off your sock. All right. Now watch, watch what I'm gonna do. What I'm gonna do is take it and try to try to grab it and go halfway. The minute I let go, it's gonna tangle. Whoop. Now that string, this is the same string, but now that's all I do is tie a knot right here. Now I increase the strength of this rope by weaving, not weaving it, but twisting it let's back up some so you can see and see it all just like bait line now now this is twice as strong this is nothing look at this watch this. watch how simple it is that's how simple it is now let's we'll see if I, how much let me use this side and we'll see how much strength I have to do to take this apart okay looks like I can't Trust me, I am trying to break this rope. If anybody has doubts, I will mail you this or a piece of this if you want this. But this is how you make string stronger. Now, I was challenged to use dental floss to tie my camp up. Let's get to it. The same routine I'm going to do, dental floss. It's a little stronger, okay? It's a little stronger than string from your, from, damn. I got some good stuff. Okay. That's pretty strong. But it's easy to cut with this little cutter that is on. Let's see, one little grab on something and it's over with. Now, same method, but you can also weave it in three strands. Let's say you want, what you want to do, this is called the weave. Just find your stick, a branch, tie it onto the branch. Let's say you want uh, five feet, and you uh, go ahead and cut that. Then do it again, and go the same distance, and do it one more time. Now I can use the same method what I did with the twisty, but I want to show you other ways of doing how to make your string stronger. Now the same method, but we're going to make this string stronger by braiding it. You put your left foot in, you put your right foot out, and you shake it all about. That's how you number where all the string goes. But this number the sequence. Left leg goes into the middle. Right leg goes into the middle. And back and forth. It's a weave. Now you got to have to untangle your bottom, but the top part you want to keep. So you just weave the string. Try to keep notice where the strings are at. <laughs> Sometimes it's kind of hard to do. 
little strands. See, most people might carry dental floss in their bag for hygiene. Then you forget, or you might forgot, you can go on airport planes with dental floss. They're not going to say, oh, you can't have dental floss. Just in case you get what you call a, not shipwreck, but plane wreck. Your plane crashes, you go on an island, you have no rope. But hey, you got dental floss. Make it stronger by doing the weave or the uh, twirl. And it will make your rope stronger. And just keep going until you're done. Now sometimes you mess up. That's all you do is start over. There's plenty of videos out there how to weave string rope uh, kink aches. If you need a bigger demonstration, let me know how to weave rope or weave. You can look up. There's plenty better information out there on YouTube. Go check them out. It's a bunch of times I had to restart, but it's still going to be done the way I want it. It's going to make it tighter, stronger. And that's what you do is tie a knot at the end and tie a knot and tie a knot on top. Then break right above the knot. Ooh. Now I just made a weave to make this dental floss stronger. So I'm trying to pull that apart. It's going to be a bitch. Let's see if, how, how much. I will cut my fingers before I break this. Now I will, I'm cutting through my fingers to break this line. Now I just made string with dental floss. Now I can tie my camp up. Same thing with the thread from your sock. So there you go. My tag is complete. And now I have to do the rest of the tags that are out there. Alright, I'm the Ranger. Don't forget to like, share, and comment. They do help. See you next video. Just to let you know, the dinner floss did not pop, it came untied.